So agriculture is an industry that North Carolina actually is one of the leaders in the country. We have an $80 billion industry in agriculture in the state. It employs 16% of our workforce and is responsible for feeding a large portion of the world. In fact, if you look at the agriculture commodities in our state, we produce over 90 different products on the farm and over 40 of those products were top 10 in the nation in the production of them. So we're, we're big in agriculture in North Carolina. Most people understand agriculture from a farm perspective. They've seen a farm, they've lived on a farm, they certainly understand what farms produce. But a lot of people don't grasp the technology that goes behind that industry. Here in the Triangle alone, we have four of the largest biotechnology industries in the world headquartered in RTP that do agricultural biotechnology. They're working on solutions every day to increase yield, to improve performance of crops for our farmers. And that's a big opportunity for NC State. We're one of the largest agriculture colleges in America. We support the industry through extension and through research all over the state but we also support the industry by producing the human capital that's needed to keep agriculture productive. This morning I was visiting one of the companies in RTP and they're working on some of the most advanced technologies to improve the yield of corn, to make corn more resistant to drought. And that's gonna make a huge difference in the yield that our farmers see. So we need to start to work on crops that can adapt to the growing change in our climate. If you look at the world, we currently have a little over six and a half billion people. We're gonna be at nine billion people in the next 30 to 40 years. We're gonna to have to increase agriculture productivity by 75% on less land. How are we gonna do that? We're gonna to have to use every tool we have available to us, and we're gonna to have to use the highest level of technology to make sure we can remain productive. And NC State is gonna lead that effort.